confrontation jutsu. Sorry guys, <laughs> I just came from watching some Naruto and now uh, it feels like I need to talk about another anime, a certain character. Hmm, who could it be? Whoa, Deku, dude, what are you doing, man? Where'd you teleport from? Come back here, get at the table, dude. <laughs> All right then. Uh, did anybody say Hot Topic exclusive Deku shoot style Funko Pop? What's up Nakamas? Welcome back to the channel <laughs> again and as you can see I'm wearing the same shirt as the previous video and if you haven't checked that one out you can go you need to go check it out right now. But talking about shirts <laughs> I am wearing my plus ultra shirt and I bought this from Hot Topic also. I saw it and I was like I, I, I need to get it. <laughs> I need to have it especially because I'm gonna talk about this little dude right over here. <laughs> I need to get the shirt right away. So, <laughs> we are going to be talking about the My Hero Academia Hot Topic exclusive Deku Funko Pop. Now, this is the shoot style Deku. This is from season two. Um, actually, is it two or three? Ah, oh my god. <laughs> Correct me if I'm wrong, guys. But anyways, this is Deku with his new uniform. Now, I really want to get him out of the box. Talk a little bit more about him because I want to take a look at his new uniform. I want to look at what Funko did compared to what the anime actually looks like and stuff like that. I think this is going to be a really good pop to talk about. But let's look at his box real quick. So, as you guys saw whenever he teleported from the anime world down to our little table right over here. Um, he looks exactly the same as most of the Deku Pops. But there's a big difference and we do have that Hot Topic exclusive sticker there. So very similar to the Battle Deku that we got a while back. But one of the biggest differences, of course, I want to point out that artwork on this side of the box looks really, really good. Um, I like his uniform. I do like his outfit. I think they made it look great right there in the art. Um, but in the back, this one does belong, as you can see back there, to Wave 2. Of course, because there is not a Wave 3 just yet. <laughs> but that one should be coming here pretty darn soon. I mean, we've seen so many things. Um, that have been leaked in the internet and it looks like it's gonna be um, pretty sure a hundred percent that we're getting wave three of my hero academia pops but for now we got to talk about this guy right here now of course I did go pop hunting for this guy here but <laughs> I skipped the lines I, I was actually at work and you're about to see a little footage um, so <laughs> I'm actually gonna roll that footage right now it's really really short so make sure not to blink because it's gonna go it's rolling right now So yes, as you guys can see, there wasn't many left. There was actually about six left by the time that I got there. And I was lucky enough to get my hands on one of these. Now, this was probably one of the best ones that I saw um, in display, you know, because I was trying to look at the box. You already know, <laughs> I gotta have my boxes mint, as could be. Um, but I also like to have two, um, because I like to have one in the box and then keep one out of the box so I can just look at it and just admire its artwork, right? And admire what Funko has done with it. I don't know, that's just me. So by the time I got there, most of the line was already gone. I actually got there, they opened at 10 a.m. in the morning and I got there probably like around 11, right? Right around 11, 10, 11, 15, I wanna say. And there was still Deku Pop. So I got, I feel like I got pretty lucky because I thought he was gonna go like in a few minutes right after he was released and the doors opened. But I managed to get him, so I'm really happy. Let's go ahead and get him out of the box now and talk a little bit more of how he looks because that's what I'm here for. <laughs> We're going to talk about this pop in full detail. Alrighty guys, so here we have young Midoriya. <laughs> so Deku. And he looks pretty cool. I gotta say, I really, really like the, sh the shoot style uniform that he is wearing. And this time around, I, I think I, I like this one a lot. Um, maybe more than the previous ones. Now, I gotta say, Battle Deku is pretty cool. I love <laughs> that they did, they added pretty much half of his mask, um, burned off from Katsuki, you know, in his sculpture of, of his head. But this one is pretty cool because it has his mask hanging from his um, suit pretty much right there on his back. So that looks pretty amazing. Um, but then you see the difference in the suits right there. As you can see, this one, since it is the shoot style Deku, um, you see a difference in his gloves, a difference in his boots as well, and the shoes that he's wearing, um, which he does focus a little bit more on his feet. Don't want to spoil too much on the anime right there, 
But uh, just to do a quick comparison, let me show you the Deku from the well, one of the first ones that we got. Alrighty, guys. So yes, I think this is a perfect, perfect comparison right over here. So here we have Battle Deku, and then we have Deku. I know the box just says Deku on this guy right over here, but this is shoot style, right? With the different uniform and the new uniform that he has now, but you can definitely tell the differences. So the suit on the Battle Deku is definitely a lighter tone of green that you see right there. Of course, you have the boots or his shoes are red. <laughs> oh man, those iconic red tennis shoes that he's always wearing, right? But here he has some cooler looking boots um, that definitely is gonna help him using his quirk better. Um, and then you do see his, uh, his knee pads are a little bit different. They're a little bit bigger and stuff like that. And um, all around, I, I just gotta say this, um, the shoot style Deku, I feel it's a better looking pop. I think this one looks very, very nice. And of course, um, oh, last but not least, of course, the gloves, right? So the gloves look much different. This one, his hands are in an open position or, you know, they're like an open pose. And this one, he's getting ready to fight because this is a scene whenever he is fighting Katsuki. So um, yeah, I think that would be pretty cool, right? Showing you guys the difference between Battle Deku and Deku Shoot Style. But regardless, I am so happy that I have this guy right over here in our collection. And man, I, I'm happy that I got two of them actually because I do want to display this guy out of the box. All right, Nakamas, we came to the end of this video now. And let me know, what do you guys think of the new Deku Pop that we got? Now, he is a Hot Topic exclusive, so let me know how were the lines? Did you guys manage to actually get there in the morning? Uh, did you manage to get this Funko Pop? Was it busy in your area? Or did you, or still at this time, at me, you know, showing this video to you guys, y'all still have these Deku's at the store. So I would really love to know um, how it is for you guys. Show me your feedback, write about your feedback down in the comment section below. But as always, <laughs> don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe to the channel, guys. I will see y'all in the next one, Nakamas. <laughs> Take care. Bye.